Here seem to be ready to. Dig things. You should be proud of. I've always said that trap... ...broadens the mind. Revelio. If one more person asks me about her... <sighs> Pardon me, sir. Come to stare at the fool, have you? There's poor Ig Haggerty, robbed by his own sister. Ah, uh, she's robbed almost everyone now. So, who's the fool? I, I, I'm not sure I know what you're talking about. Then you're the only one who doesn't know about Catherine running off with that thief, Victor Rookwood and his lot. Good riddance, I said. Never thought she'd return a steal from me. Well, us. But I just know it was her. I want her caught and sent to Azkaban for stealing a prize family heirloom. Sister or no. Are you sure Catherine is the culprit? It could be anyone. Thanks to that Rookwood louse, we're inundated with all manner of criminal. I wanted to believe it was any one of them except Catherine. But she was the only one who knew where the heirloom was hidden, and she knew precisely which homes to rob. Why would Catherine come back to rob the Hamlet if she'd already left? Do I look like a criminal to you? How should I know? She always despised this place. Resented having to grow up here. Perhaps she did it to spite us. What exactly was the family heirloom that the thief stole? A necklace. Belonged to the first of the Haggerty women. Hundreds of years old. So much history. She'll likely pawn it. I could keep an eye out for the thief, sir. You? Ugh. Nothing to be done by the likes of us. This is a job for the fine officer singer, or some such authority. Besides, the thief, my sister, only strikes at night. Coward. Long past your bedtime. What do you have for sale? What can I...? I'd keep an eye on your belongings if I were you. Crattering will steal the eyebrows off your I ought to look into this thievery business for Mr. Haggerty once night falls. It's uh, good luck for me you stopped by today. Glad you were able to stop by. Revelio.
Now that it's night, I ought to look into this thievery business for Mr. Haggerty. Hello, Hamora. Revelio. must be on the right track. It looks as if the thief took more than they could carry. Revelio! Alohomora! Revelio. Revelio. Must be getting closer. Revelio, touch your helm. Thank you for making me the first one. Who is it? Ah. Ah. I won't wait. Places, the window, the window. Glacier! Can bring us! See what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Revelio.
Revelio. This looks intriguing. Revelio. Enjoy suffering, do you? <laughs> it won't be long now before we find a other trick. A Niffler. It wasn't capturing Haggerty after all. Revelio. That must be the Haggerty family heirloom. Levioso. Revelio. Revelio. Mr. Haggerty will take this news. His sister wasn't the thief and his heirloom's coming home. I have some good news, Mr. Haggerty. I unmasked your thief. Nothing to unmask, was there? We all know that the thief was my sister, Catherine. Actually, sir, the thief was a Niffler. A, a, a what? You know, small, furry, pilfering. I followed it to its lair. Catelyn was the only one who knew how to get into our homes, where to find our treasures. But I suppose 
mangy little blighter. Well, if you found the Niffler's lair, as you say, you must have found my heirloom. As a matter of fact, I did. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. Catherine's a disappointment for certain, but I never wanted to believe she was behind this. Now, thanks to you, I won't have to. What a strange world we live in. Suppose they can't send a Niffler to Azkaban. At least I've got my heirloom back. <laughs>